Across the D.C. metro area on Sunday, nerves rattled when this sonic boom rang out. The moment caught on different cameras, this dog lounging on a deck startled, and a couple recording a song, jumping up after hearing that boom. First thought was, um, are the kids all right? The way it rattled the house. It was uh, very jarring, and I think we both initially um, thought that it had to be an earthquake. But officials say the sound actually came from an F-16 fighter jet, one of six launched by the U.S. military, traveling at supersonic speed. Fighter pilots desperately trying to catch up with a civilian jet, a Cessna Citation, that had entered restricted airspace near the U.S. Capitol Sunday afternoon. The F-16s following close behind for 30 minutes, trying to contact the civilian pilot who was not responding. The fighter jets even firing flares to alert the civilian pilot, but then... They looked in the cockpit and they could see that the pilot was slumped over and unconscious. The plane likely out of fuel, then taking a dive and crashing in Virginia, killing all four people on board. Some experts believe a lack of oxygen, a condition called hypoxia, may have incapacitated the pilot and passengers. Pressurization on an airplane compresses the air in the cabin to make sure that there's enough oxygen so that you can survive and sometimes that pressurization may fail. Yeah, still so many questions right now. According to the FAA, the plane had taken off from an airport in Tennessee and was heading to New York's Long Island, which it did reach, but the flight path shows it then turn around, likely an autopilot before crashing in Virginia. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.